Welcome back to Coach's Corner on OUGrizzlies.com. I'm joined by head volleyball coach Rob Beam. Coach, uh, finally on the court last weekend, saw a lot of good things. Take us through uh, some of those good positive things you took out of last weekend. Well, I think uh, the first thing that stands out when you look at the stats is just uh, our offensive production. The hitting efficiency was very good. Um, I think our blocking was really good, um, which are two really important point score categories. So I think we highlight those um, You know, in terms of the positives. Um, we also have things that we want to work on this week. Uh, big win over Niagara. They, they're favored every year pretty much in the MAAC. They won it last year. Talk about uh, that match opening the season. Well, I think that uh, Niagara's a very quality team. They have a lot of uh, experienced volleyball players. They returned, uh, I think, their, their entire team from last year that went to the NCAA tournament. Uh, they were very ready to play the first match and came out really uh, on fire. Uh, we got, a, got ourselves recollected at, in the intermission, um, made some you know, important changes, and I think our depth really won out in the end. Uh, a lot of players played and made great contributions, even if it was just serving a point or picking up a tip or a roll shot. Uh, it really contributed to a great team win. Uh, talk a little bit about the match with Toledo. Not the result you wanted, but were there some things you could take out of that uh, as the team moves forward this week? Yeah, I think Toledo's a very quality opponent. They, uh, they run a really good offense. Uh, it's similar to our top teams in our league in terms of the way that they run it and the way they distribute the offense. And I think it was a great opportunity for us to practice against something that we're going to see uh, uh, several times throughout the, the season. Um, you know, and then for us to compete as well as we did against a team that was uh, in the top 100 uh, last year, um, returning their entire starting team, uh, you know, I think that we did very well. Uh, and in the end, it just came down to a couple points either way. So, you know, we were right in it, and uh, I think we just built forward off of a positive result. Some individual accolades from last weekend's tournament, Megan Bray, Brittany Holberg, talk about their performance. Uh, both were excellent. Um, you know, Megan's uh, been delivering since her first year as a six rotation outside hitter. Uh, her passing, defense, ball control, serving, attacking is all uh, very clean. You know, other coaches were saying, you know, how, how much they thought uh, she was a complete volleyball player, which I think we've seen, uh, you know, over the last two years. And of course, Brittany's producing at a very high level um, offensively, and her blocking has really come along in the last year. And um, you know, this, and I think the weapon she's really added this year is serving. Uh, she went on a a few tremendous serving runs uh, and you know that's something I think she's going to keep getting better at this season. Uh, upcoming week you guys travel to Eastern Michigan, you play Central Michigan this weekend in a tournament that you host. Talk about this week's matches first with Eastern Michigan on Wednesday and then hosting a tournament this uh, weekend. Eastern Michigan is always a great uh, nearby rivalry with a, a, a great quality MAC opponent. Um, you know, they, they again return a lot of uh, the same players they had last year, and so we know what we're in for is it's going to be a, a battle. Uh, they're good defensively, we're good defensively, they run a nice offense, we've done some good things with that. Uh, I think it's going to be a very even matchup, and uh, I think the team that just happens to be sharper that night is going to be uh, the winner. And then uh, Central, is, again, is the same thing, high-level MAC team. Uh, and then we get to play Wright State again, which I think um, is a great preparation for as we look forward to the Summit League play, where two teams have seen each other once and get a chance to preparate, you know, do their preparations and practice after watching film on their on themselves and also on uh, their opponent. So uh, it's a great week of competition for us. Coach, what are a few of the key things you'll be looking for out of your team this week? I think we want to get better defensively, both in block and defense. Uh, our numbers of blocks were good. I think that our organization and the system needs to get a lot cleaner, uh, and that's going to help our defenders. I thought we um, did some good things effort-wise defensively, but we need to pick up more balls and turn those into transition scoring opportunities. Coach, thanks for joining us. Best of luck this week. Thank you.